Good morning guys. So today's video is going to be a little bit different because I figured we're skiing for a week and when you ski you pretty much do the same thing. Ski, eat, drink, repeat. So um, I didn't want to do seven days or six, actually it would be seven because we did six and a half days skiing. Um, I didn't want to do seven days all the same. Um, so what I'm going to do is try and alternate them between fun stuff. I might do a Q&A with me and Mike, so if you have any questions for me and Mike then let us know in the comments below. But this video is going to be a room tour of our room where we're staying and a little talk through my outfit because the last video that I put up I got tons of questions about my jacket and my trousers. Sure, also when I... My jacket and trousers. No, it wasn't about yours Mike because you look like a swamp monster. <laughs> we'll get to that in a minute. Um, but yeah, I, when I mentioned my trousers a few days ago as well when they arrived everyone was like, where do you... what? It's not mine, this is your one. Yeah, that's mine. Yeah, it doesn't fit very well. <laughs> what are you doing putting on my clothes? I it was my hoodie and it turns out it's not so <laughs> It's a good look, Mike. It's a good look. <laughs> Teet. Get it off your stretch. It will be all baggy on me now. Sorry. You get. <laughs> we have the exact same fleeces, but just obviously I've got the lady's size. Mike's got the man's oh, size. Um, so yeah, let's get into a room talk. So this is the door that you come in. Uh, door that you come in this never. Is I thought door. I was this is the door like. that you. Yeah, but you can leave out of this door as well, or it could be to the bathroom, Mike. Don't be smug. <laughs> Look at your hair. Um, and then you come in and you've got all the wardrobes here, which we're keeping our un undercrackers in. I said undercrackers to a friend of mine the other day, and she was like, "What do you mean?" What do you I was mean, like, what do you mean? Undercrackers. I was like, like underwear. Jeez. Anyone else call undercrackers underwear? Let us know. Or underwear undercrackers? Let us know in the comments below. Anyway, so we've got all of our stuff down there. It's not very tidy. And then on the other side, hey! on the other side, ah! there's some coats. So this is just like my coat and my um, scarf I wore the other day. And then my old ski jacket because on this side, da -da -da, we've got some hooks, which we've got our ski jackets on and Mike's bag which I don't know what it's doing there. And my fleece, Mike, did you hear that? Yes, it's your mine. fleece, I get it's it. It's mine, and some drawers that we're not using. And then this is the room. Here is our bed that we were snoozing in, and we've got some water, and Mike's watch on the bedside table, and his phone, and then this is just a little desk which Mike has kind of commandeered with his rubbish. So he's got his iPad and his laptop and hair dryer. This is my little kit that I take up the mountain with me. I love this makeup bag. It's from Liberties. Um, but I've got some chocolate in there, um, some sun cream, and that's it. Oh, and a lip balm as well. I normally have a few other bits and bobs in there, just but I pack them up every day. We've also got some slow gin, which Mike puts in his hip flask, which he hadn't had any of yet. And this is our third day skiing. Actually, so. I think I had some on the first morning. Did you? Yeah, I and had. Your boozer. Um, and then Mike's rucksack is here, which we lost. Oh my goodness, how long does it take you to find this? Four days. This rucksack's really cool. Mike, in case you haven't noticed, all of Mike's outfit has an element of lime green in it, including his skis and his poles. And his this hat. doesn't have lime green, it just has green. It has, it's got, um, it's actually like Rastafarian colours, yeah. um, but I really like Rastafari. this rucksack. And it means that I can put all my stuff in there. And we have a TV that we haven't turned on, and some stuff, oh my god. Um, this, Mike bought me this the other night and is forcing me to wear it tomorrow, so this may happen. It's a light up helmet cover that is a princess because he says it's such a princess. And then this is the rest of the room. We have a chair and a table um, on which I have my handbag and some magazines that I got. I only actually read Grazia. I didn't, oh no, I, uh, no, I only read House and Home actually, or House and Garden. Um, and my diary because I need to keep that updated whilst I'm here so I don't forget stuff. And then Mike's one piece is on here, which he was wearing last night. We actually have matching ones, but I didn't bring the gold one, I just brought the navy one. Um, Mike was wearing that yesterday. Mike's empty ski bag, my ski bag that has a few, or my suitcase that has a few bits and bobs in it. My laptop on my bed's the table because I was doing some work last night. And then I've also got in here some chocolate. I got sent this last week and it looks, we've actually eaten a couple and they're super yummy but I've got one for like every day of the week. Milk and goji berry and vanilla, dark and sour cherry. Got dark and sweet orange, pure milk, milk and salted caramel, pure dark. And then the one for today that I picked out is milk and crispies. And it's also like um, dairy free, gluten free, sugar free, like it's healthy chocolate. So um, the boys were not too impressed when I brought it out yesterday morning when we had a break. And then I have- Everything free, so nothing yeah. good. All the good stuff taken out, Mike says. Um, and then I have my pile of bags here that um, this has actually still got uh, retro onesies in it because we're gonna have a retro onesie day tomorrow, I think. Um, my slippers, which are the best slippers in the world, and my boots, which I'm not gonna wear whilst I'm here because they have sweet FA grip on them. Um, and then 
This is our view out of our balcony. It's actually not the best day today. It has very, very limited visibility. It's quite cloudy. Well, not, you can actually see right over there, so it's not too bad, but um, it's quite cloudy. We've had quite good weather for the past two days, so we've been quite lucky. Um, but that, at least there's snow, to be honest. And then in here is the bathroom, which is kind of weird, because there's this window here that is like frosted over that goes into the bathroom, where hey. Um, and then we've got this massive bathroom. The shower is amazing. And we haven't actually had a bath yet, but this is our bath. It's really like a giant one. And then I have um, all my stuff around the sink. Note that my stuff is like down there because my stuff is taking over the whole sink. I have my makeup bag which has lots of goodies in it, um, my Gwen Stefani blush palette, my deodorant which you need when you're skiing because it gets stinky, I've got um, these actually new from this works so that I got sent and I'm trying them out, the Sleep Plus Dream Body and the Sleep Plus Hair Elixir, I need to try those tonight, Sanctuary Body Butter because I need to use this, I actually haven't used any so far and my legs are so dry from the cold. Um, eye drops, I've got um, top coat and nail varnish remover, I forgot the colour, so I took it off last night and have just painted on top coat, I was like stupid. Um, and then I've got hairspray, dry um, from Orbay, dry shampoo from Colab, and then um, styling cream from Orbay as well. These are like my miniatures that are always in my travel bag, as is this, which is a Birchbox Sophia Webster from their collaboration last year. And I keep, I don't know if you can see in there, I keep all of my hair stuff, so I've got like hair grips and hair ties and stuff. Then this is my skincare section. I've got my Pixie mask, but I only just got this, and I'm not gonna lie, like I wore a tiny bit of it yesterday because I had a spot on my nose that kind of wanted to draw all the gunk out. And I pushed it in, look, there's like nothing in it, but there is something in it, but very minimal stuff in it. Um, I've also got these, which Mike has shaved and got his hairs all over the top, just wiped oh. off. Um, these are from Mask Bar, and they're the Hydro Gel eye patches. So they're really similar to the normal. Um, I uh, like under eye gel patches that you get, but they're in this packaging. I'll try and open this with one hand. They're in this packaging where take this off. They're all like stacked up, and I've never seen this before. I don't know if I can get this off. So you get 30 in one. You see that? And you like peel them off, they're like individual layers. Never seen like that before, or never seen them like that before. I've got some super um, fancy sheet masks. I've also got some teeth whitening strips because I found them when I was looking through my stuff and I might use those because we've got the BAFTAs this weekend so I might use those before to have extra spangly teeth. I have another mask actually that I am meaning to try this week. This is the Jorgobe, Jorgobe um, peel off mask. Apparently it's black um, and it like gets all the gunk out of the skin really nicely. That was a recommendation from a friend. And then I've got a um, electric toothbrush, obviously, some toothpaste. Mike is sneaking on here with his stuff. This is Mike's hair wax and his perfume that I actually got him for Christmas. This is Eight and Bob. Oh my God, it's so good. And then I've got Ultra Repair Cream, which is just like an all-purpose moisturizer. Lancer face scrub. Got my Foreo, which I was using with my um, Rhode Isle cleanser, but that's in the shower. Clarins SPF 50, this is a Skin Iceland ice, eye, <laughs> ice, eye gel, and then um, face wipes for when I want to take my mascara off, and Clarins lip balm, and that is it for all of my stuff. And that is it for the room tour, pretty much. I'm gonna do an outfit of the day and show you guys what I'm wearing. Ta -da! So this is my ski outfit. So many of you guys were asking about it when you saw um, the red. The jacket's from a French mate called Favre Blanc, which means white pepper, I think. Yeah, right. I have no um, idea. And it's just red. It's kind of a biker style, so it has like the diagonal zip. And then I actually have in the pocket my Anya Hine March purse that has like a little clip and it clips on there, so Ooh, I can't lose it. Clippy Handy. clippy. Um, but I really like it. I've, been, I've only worn it twice because it's new this year, but. Um, oh, it's a cool jacket. I really like it. It's got the zips here. I like the like little stitching detail and everything. And the black like gunmetal zips, I really, really like. And then my trousers. The trues. The trues are from um, Perfect Moment, and they're quite teat. They're like tight fitting, but they have a star on the ass there, which I mm. like. Um, and yeah, they're really comfy, and they have really padded knees. And I got she them online. The they do stock this brand on net but they were sold out of these particular ones. My socks are Horizon. I don't know when I got these, they're very old. Some time ago. Um, and what else have I got on? I've got thermal from Tog24 or something like that, nothing fancy. And that is it. I'll show you guys my helmet in tomorrow's video, but we're off up there. We'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye. So we've double room serviced and we've got some breakfast before heading out to 
the town have a little bit of explore of Salzburg because I told you the view wasn't great out here, but I can just see onto the river and there are blue skies. We're also heading out to pick up 